There are few cities where the commute stings more than into Manhattan. I would never drive into the city. But congestion pricing is about to cut deeper for drivers who do. It's entirely too much. You're talking about $30 just to drive through the tunnel. I mean, come on, give us a break. Thursday, the MTA's advisory board announced its proposed tolls. Starting this spring, any car traveling south of 60th Street will be charged $15. Those taking the George Washington Bridge are still on the hook for the existing toll, making a nearly $30 daily trip. Drivers using the Lincoln or Holland tunnels will get a $5 discount, add the current toll, and that's nearly $25 a day. Some in Jersey fear that will lead to toll shopping, more congestion, and pollution. Not all these politicians, but they're not doing the right thing. They're not doing anything about it. And we are the ones end up suffering. So we asked Governor Phil Murphy. It's ripping off New Jersey commuters to pay for whatever financial failings the MTA has. We're considering all of our options, including further legal action. Trucks will be charged more, cabs and motorcycles less. Still, it could be a significant commuter cost burden. That's about $4,000 a year. But some businesses hope it leads to a boon for the Garden State. The office market in New Jersey is available at about a third of what prime office is in New York City. All of this to help fund New York's transit authority. It's frustrating, but it's just part of life. Just gotta adjust as things come along.